I love me some video games. Hey, notice what I didn't say? I didn't say, I love the PlayStation. I love the Xbox. I love the Wii. No. No one goddamn cares what your f***ing preference is. No one cares what console you're gonna get. No one f***ing gives a sh Ain't that right, Aquaman? Yeah, I agree. What are we screaming about? So, as you probably know if you've been on any gaming websites or just about anywhere on the internet, two brand spanking new game consoles are being released at the end part of 2013. On one corner, we have a black box that plays video games that was made by Sony, and on the other corner, we have a black box that plays video games that was made by Microsoft. No matter how you look at it, it's a fucking black box that plays goddamn video games. The amount of idiotic, no, stupendously moronic comments from all over the stupid internet are driving me crazy. And let me tell you this, all fanboys are bad, but, but, the worst group of mindlessly aggressive fans belong to the Sony and PC Master Race camp. Some of these people genuinely think that Sony personally care for each and every one of them about what they think. They are brainwashed into doing Sony's advertising for them. It comes down to this in the end. Companies care about one thing. Money. Making money, raking in the cash, bringing in the dough. Just getting those pennies from your pocket. So don't come over here and say, Oh yeah, Sony genuinely care about me, the customer. They really care about me, oh yeah. No. If you are not providing them with their oh so precious money, they don't give two flying shits about you. So on the other side, we have got the PC people who won't shut up about how their stuff is way better, and you know what? No one cares. No one. Since when did gaming require you to pledge your life, soul, and logic to some bullshit company just to play some goddamn video games? Oh wait, pretty much since the internet was created. All of these companies are as bad as each other, they all have their strengths and their weaknesses. And some people seem to think that if we saw the end of Sony or Microsoft's gaming division, it would somehow be a good thing. No, if either of these companies were to stop making consoles, which they won't, they're all gonna be fine. It would be nothing but bad for us, the consumers. Without competition, prices go up, we get bullshit rules that we have to regulate to, and they have full control. I mean, I don't wanna have to pay £100 or US dollars to play the new teddy bear murder killing game. Because in the end, what it comes down to is not the stupid, boring-ass box that you play it on, it's about the games. Do you love a bit of Halo? Well then you're gonna buy an Xbox, nothing wrong with that. What was that? You prefer Killzone? Well get a PlayStation then. No one needs to be a f***ing douche about it. I have all three of the current games consoles, discounting the Wii U of course, there's no Smash Bros on it yet, and I have my preferences, but I've played many games on all of them and enjoyed the hell out of it. By the sounds of some of these fanboys out there, when they get home from kindergarten, they just sit and stare at their console. Don't play it, they just stare at it. Oh I guess it's my mistake for not caring how the thing looks. You know, it's not like it's a games console for playing games. Oh, how naive of me. Get a f***ing grip. The gaming community is, quite frankly, embarrassing to be a part of. We can't just let people play what they want. Oh no, we have to be a dick to everyone that plays something different to us. Or owns a different console. Some of you assholes need to grow the f*** up. So you like to play Call of Duty. Good for f***ing you. I don't give a shit. So you like to play Mario. Whatever. Don't care. You know what? It's not actually just the gaming community that is f***ing atrocious to be a part of. It's just the internet in general. It gives us the anonymity necessary to be a douche and let out all of our rage because there is no consequence for doing it. So that pretty much settles what my next video is going to be. I hate the internet. Wait, no. Let's go even deeper than that. Who created the internet? The f***ing human race. I hate the human race. Hey Aquaman. Yeah? You know I made that video about how I hate Facebook. Yeah? Well, uh, even though I hate it, I've made a Facebook page. Isn't that quite contradictory? Look, I didn't ask you a f***ing opinion. Just like the f***ing page, alright? I'm gonna ask questions and sh about what videos I should do next. F***ing pr So yeah, link to my obligatory Facebook page in the description. Bye! God damn, these f***ing video game people make me f***ing pissed.